The year was 2010, not a good year for ice in the Rigolet area. Upon a bay in Lake Melva where we seal hunt, or around Goosebrook where we hunt geese in the spring. Fall came late this year. It was hateful. No ice came and there was no snow for a long time. I'm pretty sure it was early February when it started to freeze up and the snow started to fall. We had just enough snow to get around on skidoo. After about two months of little ice and snow, it was the end of April into May. Seal hunting time on the bay. We all look forward to our seal hunt every spring, staying in the tent, boiling up a cup of tea and toasted bread outdoors. It was heaven. We are excited about a good fresh meal of young seal meat, a fry of seal ribs and liver or a good boiled pot full of flippers and potatoes with pudding on top. When time came to go up on the bay for a seal hunting trip, the ice conditions were really bad. It was not safe to travel. The ice was thin, full of holes and slushy. No sea hunting for me this spring. I was devastated and upset. It was stressful. The sea hunt was a total loss for me, so I was trying to get to my goose hunting cabin at Gunner Point. I couldn't get there by skidoo because the ice was too dangerous to travel across Doublemere, where we have to go to get to Gunner Point. About a week later, I ended up traveling to my cabin to speedboat. This is something which I have ne never done before in my life. It was a crazy spring like no other and I hope I will never see any spring like this again.